hey beauties welcome back to the channel it's aduni of aduni space again and in today's tutorial i'll be showing you how to make these beautiful butterfly locks using brazilian wool and kinky twist so the first thing we'll need for this tutorial is brazilian wool as you can see from the title i am using two packs for this particular tutorial but you would use more if you're making more than the amount of the butterfly locks that i made okay so if you're making more than the crochet butterfly locks that i made you definitely you need more than two packs so depending on the length and the size okay you will definitely use more than what i'm using so the kinky extension i'm using is this kinky twist in extra bouncy color 30 from lush air i absolutely love this particular kinky from lush air i've used this several times and i love i really love texture both in black color and in this particular color it's very soft and it's very manageable to use it doesn't tangle so much compared to other brands that i have tried so i prefer this particular one my voice is a bit cracky so please pardon me if you sense anything i have a little bit of cold i want to say happy new month and merry christmas in advance to every one of you if you find this video helpful please do not forget to click the subscribe button i am measuring out the length that i want my butterfly locks to be in and that is what you guys are seeing me do oh that's what you guys that's what i'm doing in this video presently if you haven't seen the tutorial of my ginger braids what are you waiting for it is going to be linked in the description box make sure you check it out if you're thinking of what color of air to do for christmas okay if you don't like this particular one check that braids out or scroll down my channel there are a lot of air tutorials that you will find helpful so i don't want something too long because after taking like this long braids out i don't want something too long after this particular one because i'll be installing this one so i'm also cutting the kinky twist into two equal parts and after cutting it into two equal parts i am basically fluffing it out so that it is going to be easier to use for me for the next step that you guys will see in this video okay and i really think butterfly crochet or crochet butterfly locks are perfect style like it's a perfect style for this season the weather is very dry you don't want your air really out you want your air well wrapped in and tucked in so this particular air style is actually very very effective it's a very good protective air style for this particular season so depending on how big you want your crochet butterfly locks to to be i used 10 strands of the brazilian wool so just watch me how i am wrapping it so i the first thing after like turning over the brazilian wool over the rope make sure that you leave space for your loop okay the space for your loop is to help you with the crocheting process when you're ready to attach it to your air when you're ready to crochet to your air which i will be dropping this particular tutorial before the end of this year because this is my christmas air okay i actually i've actually been liking this color like lately color 30 has just been entering my eye i don't know why let me know if you think this color is actually very beautiful so as you can see i don't want my butterfly locks to be too butterfly -y. so you can see that i am creating space in creating the butterfly illusion and if you look closely you would see how i am creating the butterfly lock as i keep ra wrapping it around i'm also not wrapping it around too tight because if you wrap it around too tight it's going to give you like a straight lock um effect we don't want that straight lock effect we want like a messy butterfly lock effect okay so i'll leave you guys to keep on watching and i'll be back
So now that I am done wrapping, I think I have a total of about 20 or 21. I'm basically tr trimming the excess Brazilian wool below the, um, like the excess Brazilian wool at the tip. So if you want this longer or if you want it bigger, it depends on the size of um, Brazilian wool you use and the size of kinky twist you use in wrapping it around. <coughs> So you don't need to put this in hot water you don't need to because it's just you don't need to it's particularly unnecessary okay so now after trimming the tip of the butterfly crochet look you can decide to bond the tip or you can decide to like wrap it around when you're installing like wrap the tip when you're installing you're going to see what I will do when I am when I upload the installment video of this butterfly crochet locks. I honestly cannot wait to install this particular hair. I know that since the beginning of the year I have been promising you guys an uh, a tutorial on how to install um crochet butterfly loops uh, butterfly locks. Don't worry. I am going to drop that video before the year ends, okay? So I am just basically basically trimming the tip and making sure that it has like a finished look and it's not looking ruggedy. Let me know what you think about this particular color, okay? And if you'll be trying this in another color, please share with me in the comment section. So I went ahead to use uh, my air mousse to just rub on the body to give it like a bit of shine. And to give it a bit of glow because i'm going to like store it away till i'm ready to install it <coughs> i've been coughing for like three days now so i'm just using the mousse and i'm generously applying it all over it and if you're really curious about what that loop side will look like make sure you subscribe make sure you turn on post notification so that when i install it you would also know how to do your own when you're ready to install it Guys, that is the end of this video and I'm just going to show you guys what the loop size looks like and how I decided to store it away. Thank you guys so much for engaging. Please, let's at least get to 3,000 subscribers before the end of the year. I know I've been saying I want 5,000 subscribers, but now I am being realistic. We are less than 200 subscribers away to 3,000. So I'll be glad if you guys can subscribe, share this video with someone and make sure you subscribe like subscribe please <laughs> because i know i like I, I, no i think i think we really do deserve to eat that big figure before the year comes to an end and of course i'm bringing more helpful tutorials for you guys as we round up year 2023 i wish you guys a beautiful month a beautiful december with your loved ones i'll see you in my next tutorial bye